Hello, I'm Sig Solo. Welcome to my channel and to this shave. Today this is a special shave because it's a pass around shave. Matt from uh, the Against the Grain forum contacted me and said, uh, Sig, would you be interested in getting the Tatera uh, titanium razor on the Tatera titanium razor pass around? And I said, of course I would. So he had it sent to me. Oh, he sent it to me to be exact along with all the different caps um, and base plates in titanium so the boxes are a bit beat up but i assure you that the plates have not been harmed in any way so today i will be using this uh, the first uh, one the one that was actually in the bigger box this one and that's the tetera mezzamune uh, 11 millimeters wide handle it's 88 millimeters long uh, slide overhang has a 0.63 millimeter blade gap and a negative minus 0 0.13 millimeter exposure if you take the nodachi uh, top cap on it has it has the same uh, 0.60 three millimeter blade gap but a zero 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 a neutral exposure so you get a little more aggressive razor by interchanging uh, the things uh, the heads so this is 51 grams the stainless steel this is mine has uh, it has a more silvery color to it the blue on this the hue sorry on this uh, is more grays uh, and this is more you know silverish i think so this has a darker hue to it this is 87 grams this is 51 grams okay so there you have it the soap for today is the master soap creations peppermint lime and this is one of the mentholated soaps so expect me to turn even redder if that would even be possible the soap sorry the uh, brush is this uh, the Outlaw aluminium handle with the G4 fan knot in it. And the ball is this, um, the black HCNC ball that Pete Hendricks very kindly sent to me a good while back. There you have them. Today is a plus seven. Uh, oh, it was plus seven um, at noon today. Uh, now it's plus five. So that of course calls for a mentholated shave because when it's that hot, yeah, plus seven is hot. You need to cool down a little. So because this is Greenland, and we are getting towards the end of August. So winter is coming. Within a couple of weeks, we will have frost at night um, so so a seven degrees uh, celsius centigrade calls for some menthol soap yeah i know it's different from where you come from most likely but you know we play the hand we are dealt so So thank you, Matt, for in, um, including me in this uh, pass around uh, of the titanium Matsumune razor from Tetera. Okay. In it. Oh, that's mild. That's really nice. And extremely mild, I would say. In it. I have the Nasset, the Shilat Nasset that I tend to use in my Tatera races. So I thought to give it, uh, you know, to be able to compare it, I mean, to the stainless steel one, I need to put in the blade I usually use. Tetera 
chips their razors with feather blades but that's not a blade I'm very familiar with in fact I tried to avoid it this is nice as I always say when I use the stainless steel one 11 millimeters thick that's just to me a little too thin The Nodachi handle uh, is 12 and a half millimeters thick, but they didn't, Matt didn't include that in, in this gorgeous pass around. So I will be using this handle on all the heads and all the base plates. The next shave. will be with the open comb at Simone. So that's what you have to look forward to. A very, very light. It feels even more nimble. You know, you can, you know, I always say that the 70, oh, sorry, 87 gram stainless steel one is one of the most nimble razors I have. It's very easy to get around, has that flat head, uh, so it's very easy to use, even for a, a big guy like me. Even though I would prefer the handle to be, you know, a bit thick, but you know, it's very easy to use, no problems. And all their dimples or whatever they're called in the handle, the global kitchen knife dimple. You know the Japanese kitchen knives? That's the ones I have in my kitchen too. I didn't bring one with me in here, but it's a tradition that was made and used in Japanese uh, sword making in the Middle Ages and, and before that. So. So for them to use that in the handle, the dimples there, is actually staying true to, to the Japanese tradition. Matsumune is the name of the very famous uh, sword smith, and that's actually the guy. See where he is uh, here. Their logo that you might see here. That guy, that's actually Matsumune, the famous medieval blacksmith, swordsmith, of course, uh, that made very famous uh, samurai swords back in the day, uh, in the fourth century, I think it was. I might be wrong. Don't hang me, but they're about. So, let's see. Plenty of residual slickness. I get the wonderful tingling feeling of the menthol in the soap. And it's not there in your face. Well, it is on your face, of course. But you know, it comes sneaking up on you. That's how I feel. It comes stronger and stronger. I will, of course, leave a link to this razor. below. Sometimes they're available, sometimes they are not. But they have that, you know, notified me when it's available, where you can put in your email. So, let me just 
Get a little here. Oh yeah, wait a second. Hmm. Are we done? No. There it was. You know, it will be bugging you the rest of the day and the days to follow. If you don't shave every day, like I don't. I shave every other day or every third day. So that's because my skin in this dry weather here doesn't agree with the dry air. And so I need to be extra careful. So a CNC towel. Oh yeah, now I feel the menthol. And I'm sure oh, a little weeper there will be gone in a second, I'm sure. Um, the aftershave is the peppermint lime from Martha So Creations. And this contains uh, menthol. So you will see me suffer in a second, right? Because this is... <coughs> This is potent stuff. Oh yeah. Ooh. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. But it contains so much good stuff. I don't. I don't need. I, I did bring my cream oil, but I don't need it. My skin feels fantastic after this. No need to add on anything. So I got some complaints in the last shave. I forgot to do the sound test. So I will be. I will be doing an extra long one today. I ready. There you have it, a perfect shave. Like, subscribe, hit the bell and share. Um, and I will be back in the next shave using the open comb uh, titanium Tetera Matsumone. Looking forward to it. Six out.